Landry missed seven of eight cuts coming in, and here he is at 17 under playing the Nicholas Tournament course today. This is third shot at the par five. Little sliver of a green aim at. No problem for Andrew Landry. A veteran that went at the Valero Texas Open in 2018, so he knows how to win. Asking for it to fly. Yeah, this the second shot. Great angle, even though he's coming out of the right rough, landed in a good spot. Andrew Landry here at the par three. Back when he won in 2018. Second here, then he missed a bunch of cuts in a row, 42nd, then he won. So he kind of gets on these streaks. When he gets on the streaks and playing well, it's that inconsistency he's trying to correct. Terry? Strokes game putting this year, 224th, but strokes and the putting and greens and regulation this week alone, A, so putting's really improved this week. <laughs> There's why. Six under on his opening nine. So Tony Finau shoot 29 on this nine yesterday. <laughs> Hole, ninth hole of the day for Andrew Landry, the tournament leader. Coming out of that fairway bunker, the bunkers are so good here, but it is intimidating having a little bit of water there between you and the flag. Doesn't have an effect on Andrew Landry. That's not bad there to 30 feet. Landry for birdie. Well, you miss the fairway and the fairway bunker. Just get it on the green. Two putts for par, and he's still our leader by two. Landry having made the turn from just off here. Yeah, able to use the putter here, especially from that close to the green. So, get a couple of pars, but off to a beautiful start in this third round. Six under par for the day. No stress at this point. Landry the leader. Yeah, just wants to land something in the middle of the green and try and chase it to this back hole location. Right in there, get it to release a little bit. Tell you what, you mentioned stress-free golf. Have to be a little careful with the speed on this one. Gets him to seven under par for the day. We mentioned only making one cut. When you think back when he won in 2018, he finished second here, lost in the playoff, then missed four cuts in a row, 42nd wins, missed a few cuts. So kind of similar to this when he gets it going. 30 on his first nine, made birdie it to fourth. Mentioned it, playing with a lot of confidence. This club right here has really improved this week. It's been a struggle for the season. Greens and regulation stat was not very good this week, very good. So for Landry in the bunker here. Yeah, he's got some room to work with, but he's going to have to land in a little bit of a down slope. Landry right on the edge, doesn't have any spin on it. Might have been on the down slope coming out of that bunker. So he'll have work left for par. Nicholas tournament course on the sixth. Landry, remember from the bunker, now this for par. The putt breaking pretty good to his left. Can he get it out there high enough? Yeah. Yes, he does. Great save. Tend to forget about those come Sunday afternoon when you're in the mix, but he won't. Important par. Landry for birdie is chip shot from down on the left got to here which actually was a pretty good shot this to get the minus 23 to extend the lead. Oh just didn't take the break. Putter's been working well this week's been really solid on the greens iron plays a lot better than it has this season so it's found something playing what looks like a very confident. One 2018 at Valero Texas Open. Here at Arkansas. To stay tied for the lead. That's a huge putt. That's a mentally that's a huge putt because if you finish bogey bogey you go in there and you feel like ah, I'm losing momentum. It's a big putt going into tomorrow. 